Oh, big day, big day. We are officially going on our way to Downey Animal Care, uh, shelter, pound, whatever you want to call it. But we are going to pull the dog for the tiny home. Oh, this little dude is adorable. He is a senior. He is blind. He is deaf. He does not deserve to be in a shelter. Don't do that. Don't ever turn into your senior pet. Don't turn any pet into the shelter. He deserves much better. So we're going to give him that better life. And then we'll reveal the tiny home to you guys. It is amazing. It came out incredible. I can't wait to share with you guys. But we are running a little late. We got to get there. So hold tight. Let's go get a dog. Let's go save some lives, right? We're going with a Jeep. Oh, we got the leather, Brian. Uh, if you follow me on social media, you know that my truck has been a complete nightmare. I bought a souped up, crazy Ford truck. Um, it is now back and forth between Rocky Ridge and Ford who's gonna fix it. They thought that they fixed it. It came back with no oil, engine knocking, and now it's violently shaking. So we rented another car. This is absolute, yup. So, on we go. Alright, we made it to Downey Animal Shelter. We are here to pull the new senior. I just went in and saw him. Oh, buddy. I know, I know. Oh, goodness. Okay, okay. Oh, oh, where are you going? Hi, buddy. <laughs> you just came in as a stray? Man. Yeah, he did. Oh, it's a sad case and why he's here at the shelter. You know, all that stuff runs through your head, but the thing is that we're getting him out, gonna get him a better life. And Rocky is here with us to help pull this little pup. Now, there are always tons of amazing dogs at shelters. Instead of buying from a breeder, instead of doing all that, go check out your local shelter, see what they have there. Go interact, volunteer, do everything that you can. That's what we're all about is advocacy and saving more dogs. All right, so we just finalized everything. Say hello to Leonardo DiCaprio. We're gonna get him out and we will get him back to the ranch. He's gonna stay at my house until the tiny home is ready because we are not officially revealed on the tiny home yet. So yeah, it's gonna get acclimated to the surroundings. But he is blind and deaf. He got up, was run into walls and stuff like that. So sad situation, but we're gonna make it a good one. Yeah. Maybe they Severe periodontal he... disease with hair and teeth, cataract right eye, eye inflammation, likely due to matted coat, sedated groom. So remove hair from teeth. Several teeth fell out in the process. Oh. Molars, premolars. Remaining teeth firmly in place, but still exposed root. Need further dental. And this is this is dated on the 1st of February, so it's been 12 days on that. And it goes back. Yeah, this is on the 1st. I know. I know. It's a lot. Calm. Say hello to Leonardo DiCaprio. Woohoo, shake it off. Get off. It's okay. Hey. It's okay. So we just got here. We are at our new vet. It is beautiful place they're very good here it's amazing so we're gonna get leo in there get him all taken care of and then once he's all done we'll come back and get him and yeah get him on the right path where are you going oh geez oh geez oh geez oh boy he stinks I'm gonna have to clean him up get him on his cbd in the cbd bath oh, oh okay 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 he's a good boy you're just stinky that's it all right, we are leaving Sweetwater Vet. Oh, they're pulling out. And I gotta go back and finish the build on the tiny home. It is all the finishing stuff today. Got a lot to do in the tiny home. Gonna knock it out. It's 
it's make or break, baby. It's get her done time. As we start filming tomorrow for the release for Valentine's Day. So he's gonna get it all done up at Sweetwater and he'll come back feeling amazing. We'll bid him on some CBD, get him a good night's rest tonight. Then he'll be ready to party tomorrow. Party hard, Leo. <laughs> is here they're filming part of their stuff they're the ones that sponsored this tiny home yeah this is marshall's new little girl mia well she's a rescue isn't she the cutest see what i mean there are always dogs purebred everything out there for rescue you just gotta go look at shelters now we need to go check on leo so let's go see how he's doing then we'll bring him into the home loaded up it is windy but we are doing this we're gonna take them up show them the new tiny home so yeah come on let's go all right guys we are finally wrapping everything up this is Marshall from iHeart Dogs he is who set it up Justine got him involved on it they funded the tiny home we have built it we are so thankful that they came in and believe in this dream and everything that we want to do and that they want to have to seniors and hospice dogs I mean it's what it's all about so without further ado let's do it here's the tiny home So, it has been a journey with this one. Snow, rain, wind, you name it. We fought it. We had a lot of different obstacles, but we got it done and got it done in time for the company. A big thank you to iHeart Dogs for jumping in and supporting and believing in this dream and believing in Leo, or now Falcor. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Make sure that you subscribe, like, comment, because we have more of these tiny homes coming. We got some big surprises coming up, so. Make sure that you stay tuned.